For the second time in program history, the Liberty Flames knock off the Virginia Tech Hokies by a score of 59 to 40. It was a big night for LU and it all started on the defensive side of the ball. Well, it was all defense for this game. 28% was Virginia Tech on the, in terms of field goal percentage, held them to 40 points. Liberty was always a step ahead. They knew the scouting report. They locked in. The help side came, hands up, getting deflections. It was an incredible defensive effort, and it's happened from the top down, from the tip until the final horn. Yeah, my Berkman in this game, or pardon me, Bridget Redstaff, that is, she was the key. You know, Berkman in trouble with fouls. Redstaff came to play. She had three triples. Yeah, she started off early, and when she gets going offensively, she starts to get in a rhythm, and she gains confidence. Confidence, and her points came at key times in this game. Iverson has turned into a real player for the Liberty Flames on this night. 16 points, five assists, had some clutch free throws as the game was winding down. Yeah, she's the calm, cool, and collective point guard. This team steadies them, knows what to do, always has her eye on the shot clock, and she came up big, and this one hit some big buckets. Here's the final stats and the big number rebounds. Liberty down at the half and pull away, taking it by 10. Yeah, you see that low shooting percentage, as I mentioned already, points in the paint. That was where Liberty got so dominant. It wasn't just the post, those guards were getting in there as well. And then the high, higher number of assists, we've seen that game in and game out for this Liberty team this season. They've been able to distribute, share the ball, sing, Seeing Virginia Tech under 10, that is something you don't see very often. Yeah, 19 turnovers to Liberty 17 as well. Well, the Flames back at it on December 13th, that game at home against Bluefield State starting at 2 p.m. We'll see you there.